Hey guys, I got something else for you. It's the Onassis knot. This is a really unique looking uh, knot because as you can see, it actually is no knot at all. Uh, it's completely flat. This is awesome for showing off like really cool ties. If they're a neat pattern, you don't want to complicate things with a knot. You want to just really keep it really simple. This is it. It's actually really easy to tie. Let me just show you. Just untie it. It actually is uh, identical to making a full Windsor. So if you know how to make a full Windsor, this is a great gateway. So as always, the video is mirrored. Here's my little end. Here's my big end. You want to give yourself a lot of slack on the little end because, like I said, it is a full Windsor. So you're going to go around quite a few times. So you're going to go big end over little end and up through the back on my left side, up through the left side. Now we're going to go back around the back starting at the left side, around the back to the right side and I'm going to go up and over. Now don't, be, don't panic, this is identical to the full Windsor, okay? As you can see, here we go. Now what do we do? We're going to go here, we're going to go around the front and then up to the back, okay? At this point we would go through here and make a full Windsor. Don't! You're done. Just go over the top instead. Then you got to kind of, you know, make sure it's, it's straight, tighten it up, and that's it. That is all. This is very easy. See that? It should take up the same amount of fabric as a full Windsor takes up, so, you know, the same precautions. It doesn't actually take up any more. Actually, it might be a little bit less, because if you knot not, not, not it, you kind of crunch this up a little, so you probably lose a little bit. This way you have, it's just free hanging. Uh, I've noticed that people don't uh, tend to notice that you're wearing anything special when you have this on. People don't seem to notice. They, uh, I have to like point it out to them and go, did you notice my knot is weird? And then they go, oh yeah, that is interesting. But when they do notice, the feedback is really good. So I think it's pretty uh, inconspicuous. You can kind of wear a cool knot and people who are attentive will notice and other people won't, won't be bothered. So can't really go wrong. Should we tie it again just for fun? Let's tie it one more time. If you're all done here, you could just you know pause the video, go somewhere else, watch a different knot if you want. But let's, let's do it again. So once again, here we go. Long side, little side, top over, big end over the little end on the, on the left side. Go up through the top, just keep it on the left side, around the back toward the right, and up into the middle. And now we're going to go around the front, creating our what would be a Windsor knot, and then just drape it over. That is it. Tighten it up. You're done. Onassis knot. Very nice. Look at that. Dress for success.